Today, the father of a 15-year-old girl, missing girl, is expected to speak publicly for the first time since she vanished. Yes, yeah, she was last seen in El Sereno exactly one week ago today. KCAL News reporter Tina Patel is live with the latest. Tina, what do we know? Well, you can see that signs like this one have been put up all throughout the El Sereno and Montecito Heights neighborhood because this is the last spot where 15 year old Allison Chow was seen one week ago. Take a look at new security camera footage that shows Allison on her bike riding down Collis Avenue just before 630 last Tuesday night. Now this street is roughly six miles from her father's home in Monterey Park and in the opposite direction of San Gabriel where her aunt lived and where police thought Chow was headed last week. Volunteers are now canvassing this area, putting up signs, knocking on doors to see if anyone else saw the girl or has information that could help trace her whereabouts. The family came knocking at our door and told us to check our cameras, and so I did. And I did find her going across the street um, on her bicycle on our street. It's really heartbreaking because you can tell that she was just right there. My husband pulled into the driveway right before she, she rode by. So, you know, if we had just known, we could have done something. Yeah, a lot of people worried, hoping that this girl is okay. Now, Chow's father and her attorney are going to be having a press conference later on today to talk about the latest in the search efforts. Chow's parents were in the midst of divorce, and we are told that the girl was supposed to return to her mother's custody the day after she went missing. I'll send it back to you. Very sad. Tina, we hope this somehow has a happy ending.